Hello, my children of the popcorn. Just a quick update. I couldn't resist Ronin Flix's 35% off sale that they recently ran. Uh, that is the sale they normally run every few months or so, maybe once a quarter. And it's 35% off a good selection of their items, not all of them. Um, I picked up the completely and utterly cheesy Deep Space. Um, which you can see doesn't have its wrap because as soon as it arrived, I went and watched it. And carefully put the wrap on later. I picked up Robot Holocaust, which looks to be like another completely cheesy and probably awful movie. Too Scared to Scream. Silent Scream. These all have nice slip covers. Um, some of their older titles do not, but I have most of their older ones. And finally, a Paul Nashie film, Assignment Terror, which has the Wolfman, Frankenstein's monster, a mummy, a vampire, everything but the and aliens, everything but the kitchen sink. Assignment Terror. Well, in this day and age of the pandemic. Uh, one has to take one's retail therapy where one can. And so my favorite is, of course, Hamilton Books. They have an excellent selection, and some of their items are not are, are too high, but a lot of their items are real bargains. I picked up Colossal, which you'll note doesn't have any shrink wrap on it because I showed it to my wife this evening, and she thoroughly enjoyed it, which is unusual because she doesn't like horror. And I also picked up Bio Slime, Devil Doll, it says Double Feature, um, but by Double Feature they mean that they have the US and UK version. Uh, picked up Night Killer from Severin, the DVD version for 10 bucks on Hamilton. Most of these were were very cheap. They were all very cheap for what they were. Um, I would have picked up the Blu-ray of Night Killer, but ten dollars under ten dollars for the DVD was just fine for me for Night Killer. Uh, Festival of Fright, which is a trailer collection. I am a sucker for trailer collections. The only thing I'm more of a sucker for is box sets. Um, the Strange Color of Your Body's Tears, which. Uh-oh. <laughs> Don't get flagged. <laughs> the Strange color, color of Your Body's Tears, which is a French film um, that is obviously going to be Giallo-like, because certainly the title tells you that. Scream Theater. I have a couple copies of Children Shouldn't Play With Dead Things, but I didn't have any copy of Forever Evil. So, I picked it up for that. Um, the Classic Slasher Collection which includes Don't Look in the Basement, Scream Bloody Murder, Silent Night, Bloody Night, The Hatchet Murders, and The Severed Arm. And there were, uh, I have Don't Look in the Basement, but I didn't have Scream Bloody Murder. That's the one I picked it up for. And it was just a few bucks. I think it was four bucks for the five of those. Um, Iron Master, which is a Code Red Blu-ray for um, under $10. And... Hands of Steel, which is Code Red Blu-ray for under ten dollars. Uh, these are the last two of the of the code of the under ten dollar Code Reds that they had that I didn't have. Although they still have others up there that I already have. Um, Hostel One and Two double feature on Blu-ray. I think I just have DVDs of those. Robocop Three from Scream Factory with slipcover. Again, just under ten dollars. Um, Hostel Hostel Two was. Only a few bucks. I don't remember quite what. Um, and Exterminator 2 from Scream Factory for eight bucks. Well, last Sunday, uh, Best Buy again did the deal where they marked down a bunch of the Disney steelbooks, the Disney 4K steelbooks. And I picked up these three for, for under 10 a pop. Um, Thor. 4K. Thor The Dark World 4K.
and Guardians of the Galaxy. And because I didn't have quite enough for free shipping, I also had them do Lake Placid Scream Factory Collector's Edition, which was, I want to say, $14, $15. Anyway, that's just it for that little buy. Thanks. Click like, subscribe, or even comment below, because I want to hear what you think. No fair.